What is up, Outdoor Office family? How is everybody doing? I'm just going to show you just a quick tip. I know archery season's over, but uh, baseball season's getting started. And there's nothing wrong with taking basically a bat wrap. This is a, a lizard skin, 0.5 millimeters thick. Uh, it does have some grip. And what we're going to do is we're going to take this grip here measure it out, cut it in half, and then we are going to wrap Isaac's grip on his bow. Because right now, it's pretty slick. Um, especially if you have a glove on and you're shooting. Uh, so we're gonna give him some added grip here. And this is just a very, very inexpensive way to get this done. So let's get the lizard skins opened up. And we're going to get it installed on our bow. We'll be right back. All right, Isaac is rolling it out here. So let's see what we've got, bud. About. What do you think? 30 inches, probably. We're going to go get the measuring tape and we'll tell you exactly. Well, we'll just measure it right here. How long's your bat? How long's your bat? 30 inches. So, yep, we've got about 38 inches of tape here. Wait, what? Wait, wait. Yeah, 30 inches. So, we got about 38 inches of tape. Or I would say. that in half to. Come on. Come on, Math Wiz. 38 and a half. 17. What? Are you serious, Clark? Are you, you think 17 is half of 38? Yep. You sure? Yep. Because 17 plus 17 is 30. Eight. No, it's 19. Yeah, there we go. I was there thinking go. of 34. Right. So the easiest way, obviously I'm trying to do this one-handed, is to find the middle and then cut it with your scissors, which we are about to do right now. All right, we got it cut. Um, I'm going to be switching over to the phone to Isaac so I can get this wrapped here. So Isaac, you want to take over? I don't know if I can. Here, hold hold your bow right here at the top. Hold, I'll, hold your bow here at the top, right there, and then switch to this hand. Well, I can't get hands like that. There we but... go. Alrighty, so this is pretty easy stuff. I like to leave my sticky side on, but I am going to put my grip right here on the back side. And I am just going to here, gotta bring the tape down and around just like this. Do you have the bow? Huh? You have the bow. I can if you want me to. Your big meat hooks are in the way. My big meat hooks are in the way. <laughs> Thanks. I appreciate that. You always say that to me. That's why I can't why can't I at least say it to you? Because I'm your dad. I'm allowed to say it to you. Well, that's not fair. Life's not fair. Right? Yeah. And then we're gonna make sure we get this good and tight all the way around. come back up this way and we will finish it so now Isaac tell me what that feels like on your hand bud does that feel a lot better yeah huh mm -hmm. that looks like it feels a lot better it does I need to put my bow poundage back because I tried up at 40 and then we haven't took it down yet huh you'll get stronger We'll wait till after baseball, and then we'll start shooting our bows, getting ready for archery season. All right? Okay. Well, guys, girls, that was a quick little how-to on improving your bow grip by using lizard skins. Um, obviously, I didn't need the whole skin because we're going to do Caleb's also, but there it was. Let me know what y'all think. Lizard skins. For some grip on your bow. Y'all be good. And this is Larry Johnson from the Outdoor Office. No matter what this season, we got you in our sights. You got that right.